What's up, people? Welcome back to Turbo Life Plays No Man's Sky. Episode 121. Well, hopefully we get in a proper episode today, full-length hour at least, since we only did about 30 minutes last episode. And uh, get a few more light years under our belt. Hopefully break 200,000, shouldn't be too hard. Maybe one more jump uh, through a black hole. Break 200,000 light years to the center. We're getting there slowly but surely. Hopefully gonna make, hopefully gonna make it there before uh, beyond update hits. So if you're just joining us for the first time, welcome. Thanks for stopping by, saying hi. We're playing on the PC in survival mode. We reset the simulation back at episode 69, and we are currently in Eisentam. Let's get this episode, we'll get the simulation loaded up, we'll, uh, we'll get right into it. So sit back, grab a beverage, and enjoy. So if we're gonna do it, then let's not do it for anything that doesn't make an impact. That can't really change things or push the boundaries. Let's make sure it's insanely ambitious. And let's make sure that we savor the journey every single step of the way. And here we go, folks. All loaded up, ready to rock. Ready to roll. Looking at the old Bright Mother MK4. I believe we just entered a black hole system at the end of the last episode that was ended abruptly due to uh, the, the children's waking up. So I think we'll head on out, get into logging this black hole. Yep, this is black hole system. There's black hole over there. So first things first, we'll head down to this planet and we'll check out, well, we got to get our coordinates. Did I run out of fuel? Is that what happened? Is that what happened? Or what happened? No, I got fuel. Why did it click off on me? I had to switch phones today, so I need to also bring up blackholesuns.com. Uh, dot com on my phone. I don't have it saved, so I'm gonna try to try to do that. Try not to crash into the water over here. Let's try. To, let's find a place to land first. Here looks like a good spot over here. A little stutters today. I, I did um, upgrade the graphics, um, or not upgrade the graphics, but upgraded the uh, driver for the NVIDIA. So I'm just going to sit here. I need to uh, go to blackholesons.com Black Hole Sun Oops, Heil Hole Suns dot com um, Yeah, so I did fix my issue with the, bla uh, with the black hole with the uh, the NVIDIA, whatever it's called, the, um, oh geez, now I'm not logged into Google on this phone either, shoot, okay, log in using Google, Okay, logged in to blackholesons.com. It looks like it's got my 71 current entries, so good to go. 
Uh, anyway, as I was saying, yeah, we uh, I had to update my update my uh, Nvidia experience, whatever it's called, because there was an error with the way the uh, driver updated last time. So I got that sorted out. Just had to kind of uninstall and reinstall and do a clean install. Apparently, read some forum issues on that. Apparently, it's a known issue. And uh, got that fixed. So it seems like the game's running pretty good tonight. I did change my settings slightly. Um, let me just double check this number that I put in 069D, 007F, 0679, 0079. Okay, good to go. Um, uh, NVIDIA wants my frame uh, optimal frame rate to be uh, max and the um, ground was it the ground tessellation let's uh, get the system data Back. Navigational data received. okay we are at Udamac Whoa, come on. I don't want to go over there. Okay. Udamac system region is MI W Wobot instability. Viking is the life form and economy is balanced. Okay, we got the first half of the black hole sun's equation. We're just gonna head on over to the black hole, switch our ships, and we will be off to the races. Probably just going to be doing some jumping, some black holing, some, uh, not too much else, I don't think. Oops. Maybe a little, uh, little discovery here and there. We'll see if anything comes up of interest. But other than that, not too much. I mean, I can't warp my freighter here. I'm far enough away, there must be another ship in the vicinity or something. Oh my gosh, it's just this one spot. All right, here we go. I did want to check here. I was like two... I forgot to look at the end of the last episode. 10,000... or 210,505 light years away from the center. So yeah, we should be able to clear 200,000 once we... Um, once we uh, go through this black hole here. No problem. No problems indeed. Everything seems to be running pretty good tonight. Got a 4.3% CPU usage, which is perfect. We're playing in first person, and I don't know if you noticed the change, but we were playing third person, and I decided to switch it on up to some third person action. What do these pirates want? They're not going to get me. I'm going through the black hole. What are they going to get? What do you guys want? Oh, my indium. Well, that's, that's a worthy, worthy reason to attack a, attack a guy, I guess. So if you guys are enjoying today's episode, I do welcome all the new viewers. Drop me a comment, let me know why you're watching. If you're new to the game, checking it out for the first time, or you play regularly and just like to uh, check out other No Man's Sky players, that's that's what I do. And then if you're feeling, uh, you know, super, uh, super generous, hit that like button while you're at it. Looks like we traveled 411,000 light years, that's pretty good distance. And uh, let's bring up our freighter and we'll switch right back to 
the Explorer. What the heck, oh, sheesh. I'm not used to uh, this first person business. Hey, so I picked up um, the Skyrim uh, VR today. It was on sale for like 13 bucks on Steam. That was just a killer deal. And uh, I don't play many things in VR. And I had Skyrim for the Xbox, the Xbox 360. And uh, I only played like, I don't know, five hours of it or something and uh, my son ended up you know he was a little toddler not even barely a toddler and uh, discovered how to open the Xbox and promptly dug the uh, Skyrim disc out of the Xbox and then uh, proceeded to scrub the floor with it so that was pretty much the end of that of that game so I never did get to play Skyrim so pretty happy with the the $13 purchase it works with uh, the uh, the Windows um, or the Microsoft I can never remember what Microsoft's version of the headsets are wow this is super jumpy today for whatever reason uh, mixed Microsoft mixed reality uh, Microsoft mixed reality it works with that so I have one of those headsets so I'm gonna definitely be trying that out. Maybe try to do a little uh, video recording to uh, practice for practice my setup for uh, VR, No Man's Sky VR. So let's get this uh, coordinates inputted: uh, 09B 0007C 090E0054. Make sure I got that. 09B0007C 090E0054. Okay, looks good. Wow, look at those. That's a little wonky, huh? What's with that? I don't know. I feel like with the max frame rate, I get just some weird things happening. So I'm going to switch. Switch max frame rate back down to 30. I just feel like it plays better at 30. Uh, it didn't seem to change any of that, so <laughs> maybe not. All right, let's head on out of here. Did want to recharge this? Recharge that. Everything else is looking good. Let's head up and get our system info and see how far we traveled. We should have broke. Should have broken that uh, 200,000 light year mark, I believe. Pretty easy on that jump. Oh no, not even, not even close. Not even close. Well, I mean closer, I guess, but not not as close as I thought we'd go. All right, so we're in the H I M. K I N N system in the O H T I P L band, and the life form is Corvax, and the economy is satisfactory. Okay, we'll save that, update this stuff. Looks like it accepted it, so should be good. All right, looks good. And we are already in my uh, warp, my warp ship, I believe. So we could probably just warp. Uh, let's take a look. Let's take a look at the planets here, real quick. Just, just curious, what else we got going here? Elias, a flourishing planet. Uh, 
This is what we were just at. The freezing planet. Yeah, what am I doing? I was just there. Oh, it's behind here. Well, I'm not going to do a whole bunch of flying around trying to find it. How come I keep like coming back to that all weird? Yeah. Alright, well, let's get on out of here then. So let's switch. We're going to head towards the galactic core. Uh, yeah, we'll just keep going. I was, I was thinking for a minute that I stopped because I was like, oh, maybe I should go to the space station and check out um, the uh, hyperdrive upgrades, but uh, we'll just check it in the next one. This is satisfactory with Corvax. I don't know where you, what um, life form, system life form, life form system, whatever it is, gives you the best upgrades for your ship, but... See and the zucchini system. <coughs> How far did we go? Oh, never mind. We went whatever the jump was—a thousand light years. All right. Well, let's head on down. Let's go to the space station first and see if we can get a uh, hyperdrive upgrade. See if we can get a little further in our jumps. But that's a pretty dope picture right here. I know I haven't been posting any pictures lately, though, have I? I've, j I've been just super out of my uh, normal loop and haven't uh, haven't been doing any of it I need to uh, get my other my last photos downloaded and then I'm switching phones when I use to upload everything so it's been kind of weird but yeah I'm kind of liking this maybe keep it kind of on a nice angle something like this yeah I like that all right So yeah, I need to get back on the Twitters, get to get back to posting regular, regular photos, or photos at a regular interval. I uploaded that short episode this morning, and I didn't have any photos to accompany it on on the Twitters to advertise the episode at all, and I didn't even link it to YouTube from the Twitter today. So I'm just pretty much slacking guys just slacking after this episode's over I'm gonna have to go on the Twitters and link that on link that to Twitter what is this place is empty there aren't any NPCs here oh but I guess I guess maybe there aren't normally NPCs over here they're always over here Is that right? But isn't it? I don't know. Whatever. Let's go see if this guy's got any up upgrades that we can use. So we've got infra knife, posit photon phase, pulse engines, hyperdrive B. Nope, nothing, nothing, no thank you. Oh, that's a good looking fighter, actually. I wish I would take a look at that. Alright, I'm gonna head on down to whatever this planet is. Another icy planet. And get our system coordinates. Cool looking place. I do need to. Uh, I do need to spend some more time 
on uh, some of these planets, the hazardous planets, to get that uh, last milestone going. So, what am I doing? I just, whoops, that's not what I wanted to do. I wanted to go in here. We got little blobby jumpers here. Alright, so system coordinates are 09AE. 007C 090D 0079 09AE 007C 090D 0079 Looks good Let's go get these goodie boxes since we're here Ooh, and that weather is extreme, it's really really crushing it and I don't have anything to protect me from the cold really I guess anything additional going on there that's all right since we're in here we'll just get all this stuff charged up all right well I don't know why my look speed is so crazy today I just feel like it's super sensitive for whatever reason. Alright. Head back on up to space and get our system info. Rinse and repeat. That's the name of the game. Oh, maybe a, and maybe a pirate battle here and there. All right, so we are in the Z U H S K Y V I system in the U R C I A N terminus region with the Corvax and a satisfactory economy. Beautimous. Alright. This is a single planet system. Alright, good. That's a pirates coming in here though. Coming in the hacks. Probably hey, what's this? What's this? Oh, it's just a bounty. Oh, well, I don't really care about the bounties. We're gonna I'm gonna head through the black hole and get it done. Was it cold in here? I still got the cold, cold stuff on my screen. What is that? How come it keeps coming back? That's weird. All right, heading on through the old black hole, friends get it. We gotta get it. Gotta get it good. See how far we get here. Hopefully, we break 200,000 now. I did read somewhere that um, eventually the black hole jumps aren't going to get you as close any longer. So let's see how far we went. We went 91,000 light years. 
All right, well, let's call up our freighter. Call up the old freighter. Go get our exit system info. Let's check out what the kind of plants we got going on here. Uh, my mastic space station. Let's go hit up the space station and see if they've got a uh, hyperdrive S or A class hyperdrive module. I think I passed up. I'm too close to it. I think I passed up a A class module last time. Whoa! Because I'm like, oh, I'll just wait for the S class. But maybe I shouldn't have. Maybe I shouldn't have. Yeah, see, this place has got some furniture in it, at least on this side. It was completely barren at that last station. That was interesting. Oops, we picked up the nav data. Whatever. What do we got here? Infra knives, cyclotron, shields, photons, starship shields, no. Pulse, there's a C class hyperdrive. Boring, you're boring me. You're boring me, get guys. Okay. Oh, I have it. Alright, so we need to go get our exit system data. See what kind of planet this is. It looks fairly tropical. Got some salvageable scrap. Looks like we're gonna fly by a freighter battle, maybe. Maybe, baby. go far enough down apparently. There we go. Alright, anything around here? Whoa. Yeah, this planet has a little more on it than the last one. That's my freighter icon. Uh, it's still not too much, so we'll go land up here on top of this hill, maybe. Looks like a cool place to land. Look at that view! Heck yeah, this is a cool place to land. Lethal humidity outbreaks. We're getting wet, people. We are getting wet. Where am I at? Am I stuck in my ship? That was weird. Okay, well this has got to be a picture for sure because you got the foreground, you got the, the background elements, all this mess right here. That looks nice. I think we could probably get a little wider angle of view, get it real nice looking. Nice and epic. Yeah, we'll just open it up and see what that looks like. I think it's like 150, right? There we go. Okay, yeah, something like this here. What's over here? We'll get that planet if I get it, but it's not, just not as good a scenery down there. I'm thinking, you know, something like this here. Frame it up real nice. 
with the foreground elements. Can we get it down in there a little more? Touch forward. Now I'm running out of foreground. Okay, hold on. Something like this. Yeah, that's looking kind of nice. Yeah, like that. Now what if we put some uh, depth of field on it? Unfortunately, depth of field doesn't work. You know, you can't select the focus point, so I can't focus out there on the on the water. Oh yeah, okay, no, it's, it's not in focus up front here. That's working. Yeah, that's working right there, I think. That looks good. Maybe, uh... Do a little something like this here. I don't know which looks better. Probably the very first one I did. I will try a couple. Alright, let me get our, um... Coordinates here. From our signal boosters. Looking at zero nine zero one zero zero eight one zero nine A one zero zero seven five. Let's make sure I did that correct. Zero nine zero one zero zero eight one zero nine A one zero zero seven five. Looks good. Okay. Well, this looks like a really nice place if you're into lethal humidity outbreaks. You know, I don't know if that's, you know, something I'm into necessarily, so... I guess we'll just keep on... Keep on keeping on. Head on out. Alright, so we're trying... Oh, we gotta get our system info. The... Taiwani system. To oops, T A W A N I system. In the arm, the arm of U N Y U E N N Y E S region with the GEC and satisfactory okay let's save it up looks like that saved okay so we're good to go there and let's just see what the other um, celestial bodies are doing in this system Got a rotting moon. And we got a bountiful planet. And a temperate moon, and this is where we were just at. That's pretty much everybody. I forgot to look to see how far. Did we break 200,000? We sure did. That was a good jump, or a good black hole, anyway. 196,000 light years away. Look how close we are to the center now up there in the in the mini map in the upper left. That's looking nice. Way, I'm, I'm way in on the inner ring now, huh? This is the furthest I've ever been. So it's it's pretty exciting for me. Why is there an Atlas station selected? I kind of feel like we should go visit the Atlas. No, no, no. I don't want to go visit the Atlas. Go back. Go back. We want to go to the Galactic Core. Which is pretty much the same direction. 
see, what are we looking at? 700 some light years to there. Is this one out of jump range? But up here. Maybe? No. Maybe, baby. Oh, that's a thousand light years. Korvac, adequate. Maybe they'll have some A or S class warp cell uh, warp upgrades. That would be nice. We shall see. But yeah, I think uh, eventually zipping through the black holes isn't going to get me very much closer. I'm going to have to do uh, just warp the final rest of the way, right? At least that's what I've read. I'm not sure if that's how accurate that is, but that's what I've read. So let's head on over to June Leto Geok. Check it out. place to land around here any free landings doesn't really look like it so I guess we can go land over here on top of this hill oh we got hostile sentinels This info entered in quick like a bunny. So we got 08 FF 0081 099F 0079. And if anybody can tell me what I'm talking about when or what movie I'm referencing when I say quick like a bunny, now I'll give you a shout out for your for sure in the next episode. Quick, like a bunny. Classic movie, just just a classic. One for the ages. Is this a picture right here? Maybe if I turn down the old, oops. Depth of field, huh? Jeez. It's like all or nothing. I was kind of thinking like something like this maybe. Oh, I don't like the way that that... Uh... No, wrong button. I'm not liking the way that planet gets distorted though. Try that. That'll be a nice vertical, vertical shot, I think. Okay, so did I get the system info? Did I? No. So we're in the um, B O J A S T A system. The Bojastis. With the Y I S I A R M I cluster. It's a Corvax system with adequate economy. Alright, so let's go. Check it out. Let's see what this what this planet's all about. 
real quick like. An acidic planet. What about this guy? A sporal planet? Hmm. I don't think I've ever been to a sporal planet before. Let's go. Let's go check it out. Maybe that's one of the last, uh... One of the last... Gosh darn it. What am I trying to say? You guys know what I'm talking about. Special planets. I don't remember what they're called. Whatever they're called. Oh! Space pirates! Okie doke. See what they got for me. Ooh, three of them. Holy, a whole mess of them. What is with this? the menus. Kaboom! Is that everybody? Oh no, jeez. Man, I was so, how come I don't recognize these red dots in my HUD and, uh... I feel like this is these red dots in my HUD and the and the thing are new for some reason, but sure they're not. They have had to have been there before. I'm gonna have to go back and like watch an old episode to see because I don't know. That seems weird. What do I have in my inventory? It's getting so crazy. I'll just put this in my Atso suit. Oh, why all that stuff's in there in the first place. Need to get some more ferrite dust on one of these other planets. Alright, what was they doing? I was going to this sporal planet. Is this it? Yeah. To hold, I would. Looks like a pretty crazy planet. I still haven't thought of the word. I'm just, just failing right now on my words. <clears throat> hey! No, I think I've been to a planet like this before. These little mushroom guys, but it is whatever kind of planet it is I'm thinking, <laughs> thinking of. <laughs> but I can't remember the name. Anomalous planet, holy smokes. Thank you, weather. Thank you for being anomalous weather, otherwise I'd have been just eating me up. Let's get a saving chart going. Must have turned that light off. Wow, that was really weird. 
Ooh, some antimatter. How about antimatter housing? No. Do need to get some um, ferrite dust, though. There we go. Make another anti. Got to make a couple of antimatter housings now. Let's go. Oops, over here. Huh? Look for a question mark. Any question marks? Get the anomalous creatures going. No, nothing. Come on. Repeat breach. Iteration numbers. A terminal blinks awaiting input. Let's download that data. You read these logs, don't you? You can see my words now, even if I cannot speak them. Good. That's how it starts. The infection of language, of thought, of ideas. We have passed so many corrupted things. Planets with unnatural phenomena, individuals who do not belong. Before this finishes, there will be no concept of you and I, no concept of us and them. And them. We shall all scream as one. Well, sounds like a party. All right, so I want to find. Okay, let's let's make this easy on myself. We want to look in here. Go to the guide. Go to crafted products. Head on over here. No, I don't. Oh, maybe it's these guys. Stabilized reality crutch. Calcish room. Yeah, we've been to planets like this. Alright, so did I get enough ferrite dust? Did I get enough? Just ask him. I sure did. I can make one. Just a touch more ferrite dust. It was like 25 or something. Alright, that should do it. Craft more. And a warp cell. Sweet. Alright, so since I do have these anomalous collectibles, we're not going to go look for them. I'm sure I've got some in my freighter inventory, all saved up. And we're going to just head her on over to the black hole, I think. Which is all the way across the system now. And we're going to fight some more space pirates. A lifeless planet. Alright, where are you guys at? Where are you at? Four of you? Boom! I think I'd see you hiding, lurking over there in those meteors, did you, buddy? Yeah, well, I went to Space Pirate School, too. Boom, was that everybody? I got one more. That was everybody, right? Yeah. Okay, where's that black hole at now? Hey, my standing has increased. Let's head back on over to the space station. It's got to be over there somewhere. It's a little bit of a trip back over there. Oh, 
Oh no, we're on the exit side of the black hole. Are we? Yeah, I guess so. So I just need to land on a planet and get the coordinates. Is that right? Or did I screw something up? Let's see. 195? Black hole, you are here. No, I'm at a black hole location. Did I not record the coordinates of the exit system of the other black hole? Ah, crap. Well, I guess I'll be, uh... be re-watching this episode to, uh... <laughs> to get my info. Since obviously I've screwed it up. What the heck was I doing? Huh. Alright, well, I'm in a black hole system. Maybe I already got this. Is it, did I already go down and get the, uh, the coordinate data? Wait. Okay, wait. Maybe, maybe I'm alright. Where am I at? Bo Jasta. Yeah, Gene, Merry Christmas. <laughs> I'm in this system. All right, we're okay. <laughs> Everything's gonna be fine. I don't want to go to my base. Stop it. All right, this is fine. We're on the entry, si the entry side of the black hole, and we just need to uh, go through it. Swap our ships out. Go through the black hole. Let's see how far we get. Did pretty good last jump, right? That was like 10,000 light years through the black hole last time. Not too shabby. The Spear of Jeopardy. Off we go. Where we come out, only Sean knows. But soon everybody will know because I'm logging it. Everybody on the old Black Hole Suns will know. By the way, if you guys want to get in on uh, logging Black Holes, Link is in the description below. Go to blackholesons.com. All the instructions are there. And if you would like to see a more detailed video on how to log black holes, uh, there are a lot of videos out there. One that comes to mind is uh, Gaming Mike. He's got a dedicated video for that. And I'm sure Sword and uh, Zane and whoever else. Uh, I'm sure all the... All the big guys got uh, got a dedicated uh, video for logging the black hole action. So we traveled just over 300,000 light years in that black hole. Not a bad jump. High security sentinels. Come on. What the heck? Why can't I build it? Seriously, I mean, did I like get rid of that? What the heck happened? Did I like just destroy it last time? What was that? Oh, I, did I leave it there? <laughs> Maybe I left it there. What an idiot. Maybe I left it there. Very, uh,. I mean, it's unlikely, but I guess it's pos possible. So let's see, before the Sentinel attacks me, 0639008208, 7E006F, 
7E006F. Okay, looks good to me. I must have not picked up, picked it up last time. I don't know. And I forgot to switch my ships back to my other ship. Man, what am I doing with my life right now? Alright, let's get system info. What do we get? 188,000 light years to the center. Man, we are getting there, guys. We are getting there. Let's see, what system are we in? We are in K E J E L E U S K system. And the region is the E A J A N A boundary. Bound Airy. Life form is Corvax and unsuccessful. Save that up. Saved just fine. Too close to the planet. What is that mess? I'm going to switch my ship out. We're going to head on over to the space station. Make sure we're not missing out on the A class. On an A class uh, hyperdrive. And then we'll be on our way. Oh, look at that. Look at that action coming through this through the ship. All right, we're going to go to the space station and then we'll warp on out of here. What do you guys got for sale here? Anything good? Well, you didn't sell all your front. You didn't sell all your furniture like that last station. That station two stations two systems ago did anyway. Let's see what do you got. A or S class? No. No, nothing. C class hyperdrive, and that's it. I'm sure there's a way to like load and reload, and like, oh, this has got this. So if you buy the C and then you do this and do that, oops, hitting the wrong button. Sometimes you can affect what you get offered, but we're just headed towards the center, and that's it. All right, so let's get a warp out. Let's get our warp on towards the core. Oh my gosh, where are all the black holes? Oh, there's one. It's probably going to be out of range, though. Yeah? No, maybe. Oh, is it right there? Oh, come on. Seriously? It's right there. What about this guy? No, it's even further away. No. 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 Oh, well, maybe. No. Ok, 
Okay, well I guess we can jump there. Booming, shipping. Yeah, let's head there. That sounds good. Let's try that on for size. See how far did we go? Oh, I skipped it too, didn't I? <laughs> how far? Oh, here we go. No, it's still gonna give me the the good info. No, it didn't tell me, did it? Oh crap! All right. Well, we want to go down to this planet anyway. Tropical planet. What's this red one over here? Paradise Planet. Oh, that's the black hole. Uh, what do we got over here? A dusty planet. Well, probably not that one. Hmm. Well, do I go to the Paradise or to the Tropical? I guess we're just going to go to the Tropical since it's closest. And then we'll stop by the uh, space station on our way out and see what we can see there. Thing. Any place to land? Oh yeah, here we go. Oops, settlement. An unknown building with a landing. No, it's just stupid. Stupid antennas. Anything else? No? Okay, well, we're not going to fly around all day looking for a building to land at. Aggressive Sentinels. Let's get this baby logged. I can hear one nearby. Alright, so we got zero six three A zero zero eight three zero eight seven C zero zero seven nine oops. 0079 had a typo already better double check this 063 a 0083087 c 0079 okay good got it you got it man oop alright let's get out of here Yeah, we're gonna head over to the space station. Just to check out what they got for sale. We can go a little faster though, I guess. I suppose. See if they got any hyperdrive modules here. Hey, buddy, you got any hyperdrive modules? Anything good? 
Raw interloper, pathetic weapon, blah blah blah. Photon cannons. Nothing. B class hyperdrive. I mean, that's better than nothing, right? I just I can't bring myself to buy a B class. Just can't do it. Not gonna happen. Yeah, because look, I only got one, two, three. I'd totally add one more on there, right? Or is three as many as you can do? Hmm. For a total of four. Is that right? Shoot, I don't know. I should I should watch some videos on how to upgrade your hyperdrive because some guys are getting like two thousand like two thousand light years of range. I got one thousand. Look at this. Was that Atuk's Folly? Pretty good looking ship. I like these guys with the the engine noses. I had one of those and then I didn't realize the ship cap and I traded it in for some hot garbage. Actually, I actually think I traded it for this ship. I don't remember. Alright, so did I get everything I needed for this entry system in the black hole? No, I need to get um need to get the system info. So we are at L U Y K S E Y O system in the H I K O S R quadrant and we're looking at the uh, Viking with the uh, booming economy okay alright so we need to head towards the black hole switch ships and zip on through Well, you're just gonna have to take a number, buddy. Cause I'm gonna be safely on my freighter by the time you get done scanning for crap. Alright, I switch our ship. into the black hole of wonder we go if I can line it up if I can line it up right Did we end up? The Dukeg, du, Dutkeg, seventy-eight thousand light years. Yeah, the jumps are getting shorter. Look at this beautiful red system right now, though. Man, that's nice. Look how red it is. But that looked pretty good vertical too. Let's see if I can get this nice and even. That looks pretty good. God, I don't really want those willy nilly craters over there. Uh, maybe something like that. Get that out of there. 
Looks pretty good. I bet that'll look really nice vertical. Uh, okay, so we're here. We're in the Spear of Jeopardy. We need to load up our freighter. That's one thing we haven't done is check out our frigates today. Let's see if those guys have anything to do. Maybe after this jump we'll check that out. Get our coordinates. Oh, really? It's not. It's a miss scan. Come on! I was on the planet the entire time. A high temperature planet. Hey, and a free landing. How about that? How about them apples? New Pac-Man. Cute little shooter. You got anything to sell? Got some Hurox and crap to sell. Silver. This dihydrogen jelly. Hurox. Millennium. Oxygen's not a bad premium. Let's buy, let's buy up all your oxygen. What the heck is going on there? Yeah, I'll buy. Alright. Oops, there's more over here. I thought there should be more. Okay. And I don't... Oh, let's see what this guy's got for sale. Oh, the nanites. Get those nine nanites. Grand interloper. Pathetic weapon. I know, it's always pathetic. I get it. Although my weapon is... Pretty nice if you ask me. I like it. Nothing super fancy here, huh? Nope. Alright, well, you know. Not my fault you don't have anything for sale. I already, I already own all this stuff. Thanks for nothing, buddy. What else you got going on over here? This is exit outside. I guess we'll go chart this place. Antimatter housing. Too bad I don't have any antimatter to go in it. And a microprocessor. Whoa, and a little Krabby Cakes. I don't think so, buddy. Oh, but hey, I need to get um, the info, don't I? Right. Oops. Let's see here. So zero six three F 
B8, 005D, make sure I got that right, 063F, 0080, 07B8, 005D, got it. Get it? Got it good, my friends. Let's get on out of here. Landing pads all yours, fellas. I saw you circling. Alright, so we're still in the bright mother. Which is okay, right? Because, um. We just need to get the system info. Alright, so we're in the D U T G A E system and we are in the region C E M P D O region. It's a Viking system with an adequate economy and saves. Save 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 for up to seventy five entries. And we are warping, right? Towards the center. That's 575. Can I get to this one? I don't think so. Maybe. What if I can is right there on the edge. Oh, are you kidding me? I can get there but not here? No, it's too far away. Hmm. I mean, I guess I could warp to this system right next door. Declining. Anything interesting? Hey, this is data unavailable. Let's go there. Let's go there and check this out. Let's ride. Let's roll. Fragmented planet. That's an uh, anomalous planet, I'm sure. Humid planet, and then we got a moon over here that we can't see. There's no space station in the system, right? Because there's no data. That's right. Okay, well. I if there's anything. Oops. No outposts either. Let's go check out this fragmented planet just so we can get it get it logged for fun. We'll land right up here. Copious floras. Well, that's pretty interesting. I mean, I already have the, I already have these things. I knew this was. The planet we were going to be on, but hey, at least we got air. Let's get on out of here. And let's just go ahead and jump to the black hole system. So let's see, Galactic 
core. There should be a black hole pretty nearby, but I guess I don't have to necessarily go to that one now. I can go to one further away. That's 802. Out of jump range. Sheesh. All right. Okay, how far away is this one? 802 light years. Struggling. Yeah, we'll go there, I guess. Why not? Pre full system. Zipping on over here. Four planets, two moons. It's a good looking system, I must say. I really like that. That's looking really nice. Nice aesthetic. Let's head on over to the space station, see if we got any. Any hyperdrive modules happening over there? I doubt it, since it's a was it a struggling economy here. I think. Whoa! Doing more than one thing at a time. Got caught flying into the back of the space station. What's up, tech merchant? I don't know why you guys always gotta insult my uh, my weapons. So, nope, no hyperdrive. We got C class hyperdrive, and that's it. Thanks for nothing. I, I really don't think I can even put another hyperdrive on, but if I get a different one, is that how you get it to go better? I don't know. Should look up a video, like I said earlier. How to get the max distance out of your hyperdrive. Go. It's called the old freighter. And that, my friends, is going to be it for the night, I'm afraid. I think I've had enough. So, thanks for watching. I do appreciate each and every one of you stopping by, giving, giving the episodes a chance, checking them out. Again, um, you know, leave me a comment. Let me guys, let, let me know what movie um, uh, Quick Like a Bunny is from, and uh, I'll be happy to shout you out on the next episode. If not, I'll just uh, let you know what it is if I remember. <laughs> Nobody comments, well, there's nothing I can do about it. So I do thank you guys for stopping by. We'll be uh, headed towards the center. We broke 200,000 light years to the center. I think we're going to be doing a lot more warping. Hopefully checking out a video how to upgrade my hyperdrive in between now and the next episode. So thanks for watching and we will see you in the simulation. Peace.